And just like that, we're in remote country. We've well and truly left the city behind now. It's quite amazing what, um, when he pulled up at that salt flat, there's a lot of things that things leave behind, like tracks. Emu tracks, which are interesting because you have one foot and then and then probably two metres later, there's a next footprint and then another two metres, there's the next one. So that goes to show how fast they were moving and how far they actually travel between steps is crazy. They're monster things. Up close, you wouldn't want to get kicked by one. You wouldn't want to get kicked by the original emu in these parts, little fella. The Wadjabalak tribe from Western Victoria have a dreamtime story of a giant emu named Nindiyal. She was very feared and she was said to have killed and eaten many people. Eventually, she was defeated, but from her feathers, the emu that we know today were created. <laughs> 